<coughs> la la la. La 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 lemons. I think my mic is open. <laughs> oh, there's a damn kitty there. Oh, I forgot to move the cat. <laughs> this is literally, instead of my piece of tape, I put the glow kitty up there <laughs> to cover the mic, and I, I derped and didn't take it down. Ahoy, ahoy. How you doing, folks? How you doing? Let me know if me mic is on point and you can hear me. And let's see here. Okay. Right on. Starting at two seconds. Did I start early? <laughs> oh, well. little surprise for you then. How y'all doing? How you doing? Now, this is a little weird. What the heck? I'm doing like an... It's like evening. And I'm doing a later podcast or a later Captain's Log, rather. I forgot the name of my own show. Um... What do you guys think of this later time of the day? Is this cool? Is this is this better? We'll we'll check it out. I guess I, I'd like to see your guys' responses. Um, Twitter overwhelmingly said they wanted this time slot, so I'm gonna check it out and see what you guys think of it. There's a what? Crab? Where? Ah. Hmm. I got me a new Ninja Turtle mug. Look at this bad boy. The backside's going to go digital because it's green. But, uh... <laughs> Welcome, Egg Lord. How you doing? How you doing? So, today's episode... Let me clear my... I got all these paperwork and all these maps all over the place. Get out of here. Get out of here. So, today, we got quite a few things going on. Um, it's been a... It's been a busy week, man. There's been a lot of things going on in uh, in the Seas of Thieves, if you haven't been paying attention. Um, nah, I got a weird I got a weird thing right here, and I'm not going to adjust my camera, so I'm sorry. I think my camera shifted up there a little bit. That's going to have to do. It's going to have to do. Goose Gaming, it's your first time. Welcome. Welcome aboard. This is me ship. This is how I do my news. <laughs> I usually do... Um, Every time there is a patch note, there's a new patch to the game, I do this. And um, I, I explain everything. Speaking of news and Sea of Thieves, I gotta bring this up, man. Um, the, the latest episode of Pirate Times, um, my mate Dread Pirate Doug, <laughs> check it out, man. The Race of Legends featured front page of the Pirate Times, the official Sea of Thieves newsletter. That is freaking awesome. Awesome. Congratulations. And for all of those who are in the know, I'm bringing back my podcast. I'm bringing back Tavern Talk. Um, episode three will be out shortly. Um, I'm actually doing the podcast tonight, um, and I will publish it probably tomorrow. Um, and Doug is my special guest. So, a little round of applause. Check out Race of Legends. If you don't know what that is, you are in for a treat. In for a treat. I'm very excited about that. Um, let me check out chat here for a second. It's hard to... It's Netherlands. It's kind of late. Um, I like this time in the UK. Good news, good news. I mean, I can't pease everybody. you got to understand, the world is a big place. And i got to look at my large demographics. Is UK... Australia um, and, and North America are my big big markets, and honestly, a bit of Germany, a bit of Central Central Europe. Um, but the problem with that is, is that spread the entire globe. I can't appease everyone, so I'm just trying to find a good a good spot, a good happy medium. Welcome, Lenny. Welcome. Um, there's a crap. There better not be some crap. I don't want no crap in my ship. That's one thing. We eat a lot of bananas, but nobody craps in this game. Um, actually, I want to talk about something really quick in very, very, very careful words. The arena. Now, I'm going to say this. I've played the arena. I'm going I'm to word my words carefully here. Word my words carefully. Yes. I'm going to word my words carefully here. I've played the arena. It is fun. Um... I don't think people are going to have a problem with server um, 
uh, people not playing the main game and just playing that, I don't think that's going to be a problem because, uh, because um, I don't think people are going to have a problem with getting into queues. There's going to be lots of queues. It's fun as hell. You guys are going to love it. Love it. It has some problems, but I can't talk about those. <laughs> so, like, realistically, this was kind of clickbait saying I'm talking about the arena because I am talking about the arena, but I can't say much. Other than rest easy, when it comes out and when they announce some stuff, it's going to be a lot of fun. And I was very skeptical that it was going to destroy the game like what happened with Fortnite. Um, yeah, I am careful of what I'm saying. I'm saying nothing. I'm just saying I played it, and it's fun. That's all I've said. I'm being very careful of the NDA. Um, this is not my first rodeo. Anyway, let's move on. Speaking of the arena and changes, we got some combat changes that came out, I think, this morning? Um, we got uh, Cutlass issues. My mate, if you haven't checked him out, Alectar Gaming. For real, Google that man. Or Sorry, check him out on YouTube. Google him, whatever. You'll find him all the same. Alectar Gamer Gaming is probably one of the best PvP pirates I've ever seen. Um, anyway, he's been bitching and bitching and bitching to me in Discord about the Cutlass and the new changes. They changed it again. There is now a delay. You can know... What the heck? My background just glitched. Uh-oh. I might have a glitch in the system, folks. I'm sorry. I will... I will look into that for the next episode. My background just glitched, and I apologize. Um, at any rate, um, there used to be... Uh, they took away the delay so you could swing forever, combos, in midair, without doing anything. And Alectar and a lot of people were freaking out that it took all the skill out of combat, and I kind of agree. Um, anyway, they fixed it as of today. Ooh, I'm talking about pets soon. You don't worry. As of today, I tested it this morning... If you miss with that first swing, that's it. There's a delay. And then you hit with that first swing again. And you just keep hitting with this one swing until you contact something. Once you connect, and then you can come in with the combo. You have to connect. So a little trick, hit the ground first. If you're right in front of a pirate, hit the ground. Slice. And then that brings you into a combo that you can keep doing. Eh? That's a little trick. Slice the floorboards. Let me look read read chat there for a second. I ignored it for a bunch. Ah, we need pets. Pets are coming. I'm talking about pets here in a second. I got a list here of things I want to talk about today, and I'm going to go through it. But pets are pets are on the docket. You believe it? Okay. So they fixed the cut list. That's good news. That's good news. Yeah, she's a small little Ninja Turtle cup. I, I got it at a thrift store for 50 cents, man. 50 cents. I love this mug. I thought it was amazing. The arm is actually doing much better. Thank you. I, it, I still get weird pains in the pinky section because of that ulnar thing, but it is a lot better. I'm still doing things to avoid making it any worse. I, I got a left-handed mouse now that my mate gave me. Um, yeah, so I'm, I'm I'm teaching myself how to be a left-handed mouser. It's weird, but it wasn't as hard as I thought, to be honest. It's working pretty good. Yeah, man, 80s Ninja Turtles. I got crabs. I got what? What do you mean I got crabs? I do not have crabs, sir. I will tell you that as a certainty. I do not have crabs. There might be crabs on my ship. <laughs> But not me. <laughs> yes, actually, one of my mates in my Discord suggested, what about a crab on ship? Also, I got old Salty sitting on the back again, because people loved Salty. I took him away, and everybody was like, where the hell is Salty? So what do you think of the crab? That was kind of hard to do, to be honest. And I think that's where the glitch came from. I think that glitch is part of the crab thing, and I'll, I'll figure it out. Ugh. At any rate, what are cutouts that are coming? <laughs> that are coming. <laughs> that that are coming. It's in the list here. I got it. Okay, hold on, hold on. Let's let's get back on target here. Uh, where were we? Cooking. Okay, cooking. They're coming. I'm talking about those cutouts very soon. Cooking is coming to see a thieves. You better freaking believe it. 
You think that they put a new stove in there for no reason? No, 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 no. That stove is there to cook some food. And they... I, I, I can't confirm. I've read some leaks. Oh, God, I want to talk about the leaks. I know things about pioneers that I can't talk about. But all I can say is cooking's coming, because it's right there. Oh. Um, I do, however, I did do public domain research, and I got a couple of cool pictures for you here. Okay, for starters, here's a picture of a pineapple, a banana, and it, I think it's a pomegranate, to be honest. It, it, it's either, yeah, it looks like a pomegranate. Um, so, maybe fruits are coming to the game. Maybe fruits. Um, whoop, cooking. NDA. Nah, man, those... The... Those stoves are in the game right now. You go look in the bottom of your ship. That's in the game. That's not NDA breaking. Nope. It's coming, man. You better believe it. Um, uh, the gaps in the front are for cooking? No. Well, they might be. I, I don't think so, though. I actually... I'm, I'm pretty positive. I'm, I'm very honed in on what those front of those things are for. And I'll get to that in, in a moment here. Now, speaking of pineapples, bananas, and pomegranates, there was discussion a long time ago about coconuts. And I found a gif, an old gif, of a pirate eating a freaking coconut. Look at that. I'm not making this shit up, man. This is the real deal. Public domain on Google. You can look all these images up yourself. I will not break the NDA. I know how to do this. At any rate, coconuts. Nom, 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 nom. More food. Cooking. New food. Now, fishing has got to be right around the corner, man. Like this is, I would even highly suggest that fishing might be part of this mega update. We don't know. But it's coming. You know it is. Everybody wants fishing. A lotus flower is a coconut, but it did look like a weird lotus, like a flower bulb or something. It was a de... You haven't husked the coconut. I don't know if you've ever seen a live coconut out in the wilderness, but they look different than the round things. you got to take this thing off of it. You can't just freaking eat that coconut like that. That's insanity. But anyway, we're not talking about coconuts anymore. We're talking about fishing! God, this guy right here wants to fish in this game. I loved fishing in Zelda. I loved fishing video games. I actually like the fishing arcade games. I like it. It's weird. I don't really like fishing for real, but I like fishing video games a little bit. It's a little bit of a weird guilty pleasure. I don't know. I haven't played a fishing game in like 10 years, but fishing in Sea of Thieves? Oh, yes, please, sir. Yes, 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 please. So, way back when, we got fishing rods and spears and nets in the Sea of Thieves art book. This is old news. This is nothing new. Um, Jesse Tattoo, they are bringing back the mercenary sets for all. It is true. That is true. He is correct. Um, I hope they add more types of fishing and not just the narrow little schools. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Those are static. When fishing comes, you believe, you better believe it, that we're going to get some form of actual fishing. I mean, I don't know um, exactly how it's going to look. Um, here, actually, I can do one little thing right now. Where am I here on my list? Um, fishing, two, right there. If I go here and look in my folder I should have a picture I made a long time ago no it's on the desktop of my mate fishing um, and it's how I truly believe it's gonna look here we go if if fishing is whoa what, what just happened there okay well you're gonna have to deal with that but look at this for, for example this is what I think I did this as a Photoshop with that other thing of my mate jetty fishing in one of those little things. There's these little stools on some of these spots. I I think that could be could be could be possibly fishing spots. That would make some sense. I don't know. Who knows? Maybe we can just cast it overboard anywhere. I don't know. Who knows? Who knows? Um where were we here? Uh fishing two? Nope. Just did that one. 
Fishing three. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. Um, I found this online. This is some concept art, and this talks about spear fishing, which I also really, really like. And we all want spears in this game. Um, I actually have to add for just a second that spears have been in the game forever. Just like I called it a long time ago. I called rowboats a long time ago. I've called many things. I've predicted many, many things, and I've been right. Not to toot my own horn, ding, ding. But um, I can prove it. Watch this. Um, spears, right there. Bam. Um, some of the outposts, every other one or one on every section, has spears in the corner by the jukebox, man. For real. And they've been there since day one. In the tavern also has um, rowboat oars. And there's been rowboats all over the place since day one, man. Like, they've been... A lot of the things that are in the game are in the game already. The assets are there. Um, fishing. Oh, did that one. Okay. Okay. Let me check on chat here for just a moment here. Um, holy crap. You will open up a ship restaurant? Yeah, see, dude, I like the idea of cooking and food. And you could cook maybe cook food and hand it to other people or something? That would be rad. I really hope those things are things that happen. Um, yeah. I don't know. Like, okay. I mean, with fishing, you know there's going to be, like, different levels of qualities of fish. Uh, I mean, if they're going to implement fishing and uh, 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 other types of cooking, I'm sorry, but Larry's going to be on the docket. Free Larry isn't going to work. Maybe that's why they're not freeing Larry, is because they know that he's Colonel's frickin' delicious chicken. And uh, all these pirates are going to be wanting to cook some bacon and chicken and uh, 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 ham chops or something, man. Maybe we can stick... Uh, uh, maybe we can cut up that pineapple and stick pineapple on the pig and cook that bad boy up. Or or stick a coconut in a... Make a coconut chicken curries or something. I don't know, man. I don't know. It's possibilities, right? Okay, okay, the cutouts are coming. I got one more topic before the cutouts, and then I got the cutouts. Microtransactions. <laughs> the demon of the high seas. <laughs> I don't care, man. I support this 100%. Microtransactions are coming very soon for pets. And I'm okay with it, man. I will buy a freaking octopus. I will buy a dodo. Please bring dodos into the game. They're in the they're in the frickin' art book, man. I want a dodo. And I'll give them my money, man. As long as you don't make it like 30 bucks or something stupid. Make it like five bucks. You know, five bucks for a basic pet, five bucks for a skin, something like that, right? I don't know. Who knows? Who knows? But here we go. Pets. And other animals. Boars? Um, goats, perhaps? Sorry, this is cutting off chat for a second here. I can still read you, but. Um, I'll bring it, I'll, I'll pop it up and down so that chat can still maintain some sort of integrity, but animals, man, look at that cats, chickens, goats, oh my and that's not a pig, man, that's a boar and there's paintings of boars you know boars are coming, that's gonna be food maybe you can't kill the little piggies for food, maybe you gotta go hunt the boars for, for pork, right that's a, that's a thing that ice... Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I should cover that one day. I know other people have covered it, but I haven't covered it. That ice place expansion idea is amazing. I read through that. I was floored. Mm. Ah, it was so good. I really wish... I almost need to get a thing that I can put my coffee cup down. That's huge, though. Like That's like literally like two feet off my desk in the air right now. <laughs> That's in a weird position, but so I can put my mug down and it kind of looks like it's on the desk. Maybe I'll I'll figure that out one day. But um, more like I said, more we got bats. Rats have yet to make a little. I've talked about this a long time ago. There was discussions about rats getting on your ship and eating your supplies, and when your ship sinks that they scuttle and will potentially climb onto a close-by ship. There's that glitch again. Sorry about the glitch, folks. I talked about a rat ball when I first broke the news a long time ago when I was like one of the first people to talk about cursed cannonballs, and I was close. I wasn't right on the money, but I was really close on a lot of those things. 
A lot of them were absolutely right, and some of them didn't really pan through. Like, the rat ball. The plague ball, I called it. That would have been cool. Anyway, and the skeletal things, those are going to be skins, obviously, for um, for the pets, right? You know skins are coming. Um, bat wings for potions. That's part of crafting. That's a whole nother topic. I don't know if that's coming as soon as we want it. I think it is coming, but I think that might be next couple of updates way down the way down the road here um now as far as bird types now again these are just sort of prototype uh, from the art book but they do talk about different colorizations so this is going to be um potentially skins that you can buy maybe you can earn skins in game like you buy the pets but you can earn the skins like how you can earn tattoos that makes sense right you can you have to do some crazy quest to get that skeleton one like one of those skeleton cats or a skeleton bird? You have to do a crazy... Maybe you gotta kill frickin' old uh, Flameheart to get the skeleton skins. Something like that, right? That would be cool. That would make some sense, yeah? Let me talk. check on chat here for a second. Um, <laughs> perks for animals? Uh, they said no. They said that, like, they've, they've really um, talked about not doing perks for animals, but I could see it, it being small and minor perks, like maybe cats help get rid of the rats on your ship. You know, that kind of thing. Something that wouldn't really change the game, wouldn't give you a, 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 a bonus over another pirate, but I don't know. Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? One thing Joe did confirm, ba-boom, baby! We're gonna be able to shoot pets out of frickin' cannons, man. That's right. Pow! We're going to be able to shoot our pets out of cannons. He said it in a live stream like three days ago, man. The one with um, uh, 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 Captain J from uh, the Crow's Nest um, last week's stream. By the way, congrats, Jay. They confirmed it. You can shoot pets out of cannons. He said, why, why wouldn't you? We love shooting everything out of cannons. Also, there's rumors that we can shoot food out of cannons eventually. So that's a thing. That's got me kind of excited, not gonna lie. What about big crews on galleys? That was actually another little thing. Is There's potential about changing the number of pirates on ships. Potentially upping it by a notch or something. Um, potentially giving us a five-person galleon, or a three-person sloop, or a four-person brig, and eventually, the friggin' man of war. Eventually, um, could you imagine though? Could you imagine in arena um, having some sort of a mode like a bunch of pirates against a man of war? Oh my god, how cool would that be? Like a bunch of sloops, like five sloop ships or four sloops against one man of war that'd be a rad mode like rare if you're listening that's a freebie on me um okay you've been asking you've been patient i've been delaying it and skirting it around cut out time baby cut out time you guys want to talk about cutouts did i hear something about some cutouts i freaking know what they are. Well, okay. Disclaimer. I wish I had a tinfoil hat. I need to make a tinfoil pirate hat. That'd be awesome. I'm going to I'm gonna do that one day. <laughs> make a tinfoil pirate hat so I can put it on when I'm talking about speculations. Um, I don't think they're for fishing. No. I do not think they are. Right there. Boom. Jason said it. Grappling guns. That's it. I think it's grappling guns. And I'm going to tell you why I think it's grappling guns couple of reasons. Number one, oops, spears. Number one, spears. Spears, spears, spears. I can't talk about this enough. Freaking harpoons. Number two, there was some leaked information, not leaked, un... not very well worded by some developers that got some Redditors and some people on a hunt and some words he said that that the reason for those cutouts was 
posted long ago. There was already imagery and video of why those cutouts were in the game from a long time ago, from the early pre-alpha ugly uh, pill pirate days. You know what I'm talking about. If you haven't seen the ugly pill pirates, man, go do yourself a favor and look up the pre-alpha pictures, man, because it's a freaking howl. It's so funny. Anyway, are you guys ready for this? Are your souls ready, my mates? Give me a yes sir in chat if you're ready to find out what these cutouts are for. I want a yes sir. I'll take a sip of grog while I'm at it. Although I'm also waiting on stupid YouTube's delay, so I'm going to have to sit here extra long. <laughs> and I know you do. Here we go. Look at the front of that ship. Do you see two little black things on the front of that ship? Look at that. Do those look like mini cannons on the front of the ship? Those aren't... Those are not lanterns, my friend. Those are not lanterns. That is a butt-ugly harpoon gun from early, early potato days. That's it, man. That, I'm confirming this shit right here. Whoop. I'm going to get demonetized. Confirming this shite. Look at that right there. That, my friends, is a harpoon gun. That is a small, rotating little mini gun on a swivel. That is a swivel gun. That is not a cannon. I believe that we got one of two options. We're either gonna get a harpoon gun with spears, like this, shooting spears out. God, I love this new app. By the way, you guys don't know about Slobs, Streamlabs, OBS, man? It comes with a paired app that you can change shit in real time, man. It is, it is freaking cool. Get it, if you're a streamer, man. It is, it is a game changer. One of two possibilities are coming here. We either got harpoon gun, which is everybody's been screaming for harpoons, man. Harpoon gun. Or a cursed cannonball only swivel gun that fires only cursed cannonballs. This makes sense. This would help. This would do everything the harpoon gun would need to do by shooting forward a little bit to slow down chasing ships. Hey, Fuzzy, welcome aboard, my man. But that's what I truly believe that these cutouts are for are these weird old school harpoon guns from the early, 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 early potato alphas. Um, I think it was Mike Chapman or that grog dude, somebody said on Twitter that the reason for those cutouts was in an old picture and some old footage they, that they had had it a long time ago. And some people, I, I got to thank um, somebody here. Hold on. Um, somebody on Twitter um, actually brought this information up to me this morning. Um, Robin BC, that's right. He's actually a BC boy. He's even a Canadian. Robin BC on Twitter. Thank you, sir. He brought this up to my attention this morning. Okay, so this isn't like anything I've been... Saving for a long time. This is brand new news to me. I did a bunch of reading, and I thought this was freaking amazing, and it was time. It was time to talk about this. But there you go, folks. That's what I believe it is. It's going to be spears, spear gun, or uh, a, a, a cursed cannonball swivel gun. But I'm almost positive. I, I, I can't confirm. I don't work for Rare. I haven't seen anything that I'm not supposed to be talking about. But I'll tell you, that's what I believe it is. Yep. That's where I'm at with it. See, harpoons would make some sense because you want to harpoon the shark. Everybody's been freaking out about whales. And if we're implementing fishing, this game doesn't do anything little, right? This game doesn't make little megalodons and little krakens and stuff, right? If we're getting little fish, you better believe there's going to be bigger fish fish maybe that's too big for our rod that we got to do something about like maybe not quite megalodon big but maybe a whale or a large maybe sharks maybe other sea monsters i don't know man um also it could attack ships you could you could uh, uh, uh shoot a ship that um they might have to go and uh, uh the uh, the other ship might have to use their cutlasses to cut your rope off you know um 
that's an easy mechanic. That doesn't... Uh, maybe make it... I don't know. Maybe make it really, 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 really slow to reload or some shit. Um, so that it doesn't become too super OP. But um, that's what I believe it is. I do not know for sure. But all signs point at grappling harpoons. Yeah. So... That's pretty much the end of my show today. I can uh, I can stick around, do a little bit of question and answer, talk with the chat for a few more minutes. But uh, I think that's about all I got for news today. I had to do this. There was a lot to talk about. Like I said, there's some things coming out. That mega update on the uh, the 20th of next month, on the birthday of the release of this game. Like, wow, man. I've been covering this game for over a year now. Uh, my first video was um, late... Uh, uh, February. And it's late February. So it's been my year anniversary covering this game, and the game officially, the NDA, lifted off of it for YouTubers about two weeks before the game came out. And that's one of the reasons this game got so hype. Is because, uh, uh, you know, a bunch of people like me were, like, allowed to all of a sudden create in a thing that only there was a small group of us playing. And that's one of the reasons I'm even here today is because I made a couple of videos, and you guys like it. So thank you very much. I appreciate you. Snooping. Yeah, man. Are they going to reveal a road map? I hope so. I am truly, truly hoping that with this mega update that we're going to get um, uh, uh, a, a new road map. Uh, uh, there's just... There's too much... There's too much they're working on, man. Like, I know... I know personally... a probably maybe one third to a half of what's actually in the roadmap due to being in some Pioneer stuff. And I know a lot of things that they've been talking about for future updates, and they said that they've got years worth of stuff in the works. So, man, buckle your seatbelts, mates. <laughs> this is going to be a long ride of adventure man and I'm going to I'm going to try to stick it out man and stay with it and keep on the news cuz I like this stuff man Hey right on Hey Jason hit up my Discord man we'll we'll sail in Pioneer sometime Um Yeah I can't uh I can't play Anthem It's just not my kind of game man it's too uh too what you call it too bullet hungry you know? Weird. Whoa. Rep rap. Holy crap. Thank you, sir. My, uh, notifications aren't going off, I don't think. Holy shit. There it is. It was just delayed. <laughs> that was loud. <laughs> Thank you, good sir. I love treasure. I love getting some booty. That is awesome. <laughs> Uh, could I address the new combat adjustments? I kind of did a little bit. I, I, I guess I, I, I skirted around a few things. Okay, they did fix the patch with the double gunning issue again. This is They did do a double patch. I don't know how people were doing it. I don't care because I never double gunned myself. But apparently, I mean, okay. I've taken two guns, but I was never into that bang, bang bullshit. Like, that's, I like the sword, man. I'm a, I'm a cutlass and a pistol man. I don't even like the frickin' eye of reach very much. That's for frickin' sniping skeletons on shore and taking out frickin' uh, uh, collecting kegs off of skeletons. That's what that's for, for me. Um, but they fixed the double gunning issue and they fixed that delay thing everybody was freaking out about, about the, the no delay on the swords. Now, if you miss that first shot, you just swing like that, man. Just one swing. You miss. You miss. But if you connect, you can go ding, 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 and you can get that combo off if you connect. Now, there's been an old school way around it, sort of, is look at the ground a little bit and take your first swipe at the ground. You'll connect with the soil and then raise your thing up to a mid again and you can come back in with those other two swings. So you can at least get a two swing combo, potentially your third, off of tinging the ground first and then continuing the combo. That's an old school pirate trick. Check that shit out. You can put that in the bank. <laughs> ah. 
Holy crap! More booty! Yes! More booty! Keep it going! <laughs> Thank you, sir! Uh, you usually only watch the video on demand. I'm glad you caught me live. Hey, I'm changing my times. I'm trying to see if I can get this in a better time slot for everybody. And sorry, Rep, I didn't actually read your thing. Keep up the good work. Love your videos and captain's logs. Thank you, sir. Um, I love doing the captain's logs, man. I think these things are fun. Um, I'm hoping that one day my green screen knowledge and setting up of doing all this... This is all live in OBS. I ran it off a mouse by myself, and I'm still by myself, but I'm using the app, like I said. I got this uh, 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 Slobs app. It's an awful name. It's the Streamlabs slash OBS. It's called Slobs. Terrible freaking name. <laughs> Absolutely. They should freaking give me some money. I should actually approach them because of the crazy things I do in Streamlabs, all in real time. I create these trippy weird sets. I think they're cool. Anyway, enough of tooting my own horn. Um, let me read chat here for a second. I, I uh, Would you like the ship classes with ramming ships? Um, mm, I don't think the classes matter. I would like to see certain... <coughs> more customizations to the ship. I would like to be able to see you to be able to put armor on your ship. I would like to be able to see you put ramming plates on the front so that you can ram like a big blade or something for smashing into another ship and actually doing some damage when you hit them and freaking... Because we can hit ships hard, but it doesn't do anything. I mean, like, you might get a little, like, one hole or something from, from, from rubbing. <laughs> but come on. Let's put a frickin' spike on the front of that bad boy or a big axe blade that cuts through the water and boom, puts a big hole or puts a couple holes, like something from ramming, but maybe make it so that it slows your turning down. You know what I mean? Make it a balance thing. I don't know. I would like that. That sounds cool. Um, yeah. Anyway, I think I'm gonna peace out right around here, mates. Thank you for watching. Much pirate love, as always. Um, don't forget to uh, follow me on Twitter. And check out my Discord. And subscribe. And like this video. And share it with all your friends. That's a couple other things. Um, but those kinds of things, man. I appreciate the support. Um, the link's below to everything you need. Um, right on. And I'll see you around, guys.